Hi, this is Moppin, back with more Horizon Forbidden West. In the last video, we learned how not to collect Wide Maw Tusks. Boy, that was tedious. In this video, we are going to be doing odds and ends in the Utaru area. We've still got some unfinished business here and there on the map. So if you like exciting videos, I wonder how many Wide Maws I killed. 16. It felt like 60. Uh, just to get two tusks. Boy. Okay. Um, Plowhorn override. We cannot do that yet because we don't know where the Plowhorns are at. Alright, let's look at the map. We've got a few things. We've got a question mark here. No idea what it is. Um, I don't even know if we can... Yeah, we should be able to get to it, because there's a trail that goes through here. Um, let's do that first, since we're sort of nearby. We've also got a Thunderbird here with a drone, so we need to do that. Um, not going to go through the high turning. Let's start there, and then we'll see where we go. All right, so I'm going to fast travel to this campfire. And put a marker there. We should be able to follow a trail to it. Get some of these. I feel like I've kind of taken a break on getting Ridgewood. Um, should I be going up here? No. The environments are so beautiful. I should be hunting more birds. There's a bird right there. <laughs> I did not hit it. There we go. Just meat. Owl meat. Never tried it? I'm sure it's delicious. Looks like an Utaro shrine. I wonder what it's for. Alright, let's check out the shrine. Oh, look at this. We've got... Oh, something swimming that I think this is the uh, the crocodile machines. Snap mall, yes. What do we have here? Oh, we can uh, search this car. <laughs> Engine crate. Okay. Hey, why would you have a wristwatch in your engine crate? Okay, there's something in the middle of this. There's a bus. Oh, what is that? I bet snap moths are as fast under the water as they are on land. <laughs> I bet they're deadly in the water, and I do not want to fight one in the water. 
I do like fighting them on land, though. They were a fun fight in the first game. Um, there's a land god down there. What's it doing? Okay, and a rock barrier and something. Alright, can I shoot arrows under into the water? <laughs> no. Maybe precision? No. I wonder how you, um, or if you are meant to fight machines underwater, because when Aloy's underwater, she can't really do much. She can swim, she can open containers. Got it. <laughs> okay. All right. That was uh, that was good. That was scary. Could have been bad. Oh, I got its purge water canister. All right. Don't fall in the water. Uh-oh. Come on. There we go. See if I can get that other canister off. Good. Did I get it? I'm not sure. No, I didn't. <laughs> How high did I fly? Machines are really good at um, predicting your where you're going to be. No, no, you. <laughs> that was almost the end of Aloy. That was amazing that I did not get hit. Alright. Okay, the most fun thing to do with them was to blow that sack. That freeze sack. Okay, I didn't do it, but... No! It found the water. Come up here and fight. No, 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 no. Alright, this is a mistake.
All right, that's easy enough. Did I hit it? Right, let's try to blow that sack underneath it. Not when we're this close, though. It's gonna be hard if we're up on a hill. Thank you, trees. your head up. Frozen alligator. All right. That was fun. This video had a little bit of excitement in it after all. All right, I don't think there are any more. Can I get this stuff without drowning? Okay, that's just... Go, come on, go Aloy. Okay, we need to pry this open. Up, go up, come on. Alright, I really pushed that too far. I think she could have gone up faster. And it's night. It's gonna make it even harder. Alright, let's pry this open. Is it a... bus? What is it? It's an ancient compartment. Oh, we got a blocked path too, I think. Right, go down here. Okay, another metal eye. Love to get them. That is so beautiful. Alright, there's a part over here. Let's get it. What's that? Alright, what is this this land god doing down here? Is it stuck? Alright. There's a blocked path. Okay, let's go up. Okay, I think we need to... We need to free it from those rocks. Does the map tell us anything? Missing tool. Alright. So we can't do anything here yet. Is there anything else we can pick up? 
something here. Nice. A lot of stuff. Yes, go up. Alright, we'll have to come back once we get something that um, can pry rocks. I don't know. I thought our spear could already do that. There's light here. Where's that coming from? Alright, I just want to look one more time. Unavailable. R2. Alright. Well. It's probably so hard for her to swim, swim up because her clothes are completely waterlogged. All right, that's interesting. I'm sure that Utaru would be happy if we could free that land god. All right, let's go to where the Thunderjaw is. Um, haven't been through here, but I don't really don't really care <laughs> about going through a bristle back site. It's a little bit grayed out on the map. Let's go back to this campfire and then we'll fast travel closer to the Thunderjaw. And uh, did I investigate this shrine? No. So it must be a shrine to the land god. They got trapped down there. Oh, good. Purple. What do we got? Oh, an owl wishbone. <laughs> Does it? Okay, yeah, it does. So you can get a few more berries. I don't see any. Well, we have a good good amount. Okay. Where's the thunder jaw? Okay, here. So let's We did that. All right, let's go to the shelter? Can we fast travel to a shelter? Yeah. That's good, we can make it morning. So beautiful. Alright. Six hours. Let's go six hours into the future. Um, we could replenish from our stash here, but let's not. 
All right, the Thunderjaw is here. All right, one more berry. Here it is. Look at this. This one is growing inside of a rock. That's a rare sight. Oh no, this is growing on the side of a rock. Never mind. So we need... We need to, um... Jump on that drone, and where it's at now... Seems to be a good spot where you could maybe jump and then you would float down with it and then get its data but of course if the thunder jaw was there <laughs> you would have a hard time acid could work against that machine. yeah that would be great if we had acid Let's just do a shot. <laughs> Is it that far away? Is it that big? I don't think so. But maybe. Have to jump onto that drone to get it down. Mm -hmm. Let's try. Okay, Aloy, I want you to kind of go to the right here. So the drone is going to come about here. If it comes now, that would be great. Where is it? Can I tag it? No. Okay. Going down. Come on. Got it. No! Aloy, jump! I get the data from the drone. Okay. Got the data. Alright, that was easier than I thought. I still want to fight a Thunderjaw. Um... Maybe I should save the game before I do that, though. Where's the nearest campfire? Oh, it's far away. Alright. Because I don't like my chances. gonna try to shoot that owl but uh, I was too slow is this in a uh, cave oh yes run up that's good actually like that Okay, it's here. All right, let's go back. And see if we can kill a Thunderjaw. We can get 
use of this. I don't remember much about Thunder Jaws. Can they uh, scan? Alright, I did not hit the part I wanted. It's such a small sliver of damage to it. You can knock it down. Look at these. Probably not. Obviously, I should tag it, right? If I'm gonna play this game. Look at that. Okay, it's scanning. Oh! Okay, that's new, right? I don't think they did that before. So can it scan me and find me here using that, um, I don't know, what it, that sensor? Yes! Alright. <laughs> That's new. They could not do that before. I do remember that. All right, let's switch to our precision, since it's going to be far away. I really want to take that off, but because I don't want it to be able to find me. Good, good. Okay. Alright, got that, that off of it, so... If I wait, I should be able to go back and... 
it won't be able to find me as easily. It shouldn't know where I'm at now. I, oh, okay, it's close. It should give up, I would think. Love how Aloy can slide uphill. Okay, good. Alright, let's uh, try again. Got it. I don't know what that is. Okay. Alright, it shouldn't know where I'm at. How's its health? Okay, I made a dent. Let's try to get its, um, maybe its missiles off next. Nice big target. I'm a hot hey boy. How can you miss? Uh oh. This is a lot of fun. <laughs> Okay, it saw me. Are you helping? I hope not. You don't see me. <laughs> it doesn't because it's behind a rock. Oh, now it's not. Was the other one I was hitting, right? Don't mind if I do. bump into me. I think it's 
hitting the rock. Look at all the arrows sticking out of those missiles. Batteries. Good. Did I get two of them off? Yeah, I think I did. Yeah. But still got a lot of health. Alright, what should I target next on it? Wait. Where is it? Uh... Can't see it. Okay. There it is. The little triangles blending in with the r rock and all the yellow lines. Oh, I don't... well... Alright, let's... Let's do, use this. Not a big fan of picking up and using these weapons, but... Oh, okay, that was it. It will take a long time to shoot it... to death. That's <laughs> my... Oh, boy. With my hunter bow. Alright, how's it doing? Health. Still got more than 50% health. It's trying to shoot me through this rock. Let's see if I can do a strike from above on it. That's too far away. Needs to be closer. Didn't give me the option. <laughs> okay. Turn, this around. Turn what around? I mean, it's not going south yet, is it? I shot off two parts. Oh, there's one. It's over there. All right. I'm gonna use it. Oh no, I missed. Get up! Oh, it's dead. Alright, well, I hit it a few times. Maybe you can't do a strike from above on machines this big. But you should be able to.
I think that is a one hit kill. kill. And get that gun off. up. Good, got that one off. My aiming is not very good. What are you shooting at? I think it's confused. Really does a lot of damage. Whoa! <laughs> this took off. All right, it's probably not the best place to be. this. Okay. Got it. Okay. Almost got it down to a quarter of its health. I'm gonna see if I can knock it down. It might be a waste machine muscle. Can't knock it down, right? There's no way. to shoot its legs as much as possible.
I don't trust that that attack is sometime going to go right through the rock. Oh, it worked! Come on. Hurting it. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna... Try melee one-on-one. -on -one. I don't think that would end well. Alright, I did knock it down, but... It took a while, it's kind of boring. Let's see if we can get that part off next. I don't know what it is. Got it. Oh, there are two. Okay. Go. Oh, okay, good. I'm just going to shoot it now. Oh no! <laughs> Alright, that was almost the end. That would have been so disappointing. Alright, I need to uh, be a little smarter. It's almost dead. Not only smarter, but actually aiming well would be a good idea. Hit a weak spot. I did it! Okay! Alright, the first Thunderjaw that I killed in Forbidden West. Okay, what did we get? Frost defense plus 14%. Not that exciting. What did we knock off way back in the beginning? It's, it's tail. Okay, Thunderjaw tail. Alright. Someone's going to ask for one at some point. Ammo drum. Alright. We got a lot of machine muscle. That's good. Is there anything else of interest in this area? We were in already at this um, rebel outpost earlier. for parts. That can't be good. Yes, I know. We saw it before. Machine Metal shards. Probably for weapons and armor. Saw some health. I'll fill up while I can. All right, let's look at the map. I don't know if there's any other question marks we 
I think we have to swim to get to this one. So I'm going to wait on it. Got a new quest here. Not going further west, so I'm not going to see what that is. Oh, we've got this um, this Vista Point tower, tower we never lined up. Let's do that if we can. Um, here we go. Save. Um, if you remember, at that Vista Point, I kept backing up and up and up the uh, cliff side and I got killed by machines and then the the AR image was no longer in my focus and I couldn't go back and scan it that purple circle at the base of the, of the tower was no longer there all right hopefully it will be back what was that flash? Is that lightning? Over there? Let's look. There's a, it's actually storming at my house right now. Okay, I have no idea. But there was a flash. A few. Alright, we are full up on berries. But they're just so irresistible. That's oh, a raccoon. Any birds around? Oh, a squirrel. Oh, good. And it's got something purple in it. A bone. <laughs> uh, I like how you kill. I can range of the vista point. Kill animals and you don't always get bones. Okay, it's not there. So how do I get it back? It was at the base of the tower here. You can scan it. This box. I don't know if it's here or not. Um, collectibles. Okay, Vista points. Do the daunt. Yeah, it's not here. How do you get it back? I was just backing up and up and up the cliff here, and there are some machines, flying machines up there. Might have to look online to see if, if that's a bug or I'm missing something. It's really annoying. I climbed up, climbed up here and then was killed by machines. Oh yeah, look. Just more signs that the terraforming system is out of control, I guess. This strange red lightning. Alright, I have no idea how to get that back. I will have to look online. Alright, so there is more... On the Discord group, um, I would mentioned I was looking for w wide maw tusks and having a hard time, and John V, it's, this is the, the playthrough Discord group, mentioned that in Barren Light, there was um, a bow that had good tear. So, let's go look. And maybe also, um, Chris Worthington mentioned Q's bow. 
that we got in River Him. Maybe that one is good. All right. To Baron Light. Plasma. I was re-watching my video of um, the Dying Lands, and I got killed by Plasma in the repair bay, according to the game. But I hadn't seen Plasma yet, so... I don't know if that was supposed to happen or not. Okay, weapons. Okay, what do we have? Whisper Hunter Bow. Slice, okay. I thought John V mentioned the slicing bow, but this is uh, more like a sling or something. You catch it, it's kind of like a boomerang. The Whisper Hunter Bow. It's sold out! <laughs> okay, I have one. So I guess... Alright. Uh, let's look at... Thanks, Red. Nope. Anything else? Problem. See me. Don't call me Red. Um, let's look at... Uh, Q's Bow. Q sharp shot bow. Okay, it does do more tear. It would go up to 80 tear. And you get a new slot. Critical hit chance goes up. I could upgrade it all the way. But... I don't know if I... That would take me up to 80 tear, but it uses sharp shot ammo, right? Need to go out and look. Hunter arrows. Yeah, precision arrows. Oh, I do have I do have something that can shoot acid. I didn't know. <laughs> Okay. Um, yeah, I still think this is better. Um, even though that would go up to 80, this uses just regular um, hunter arrows, which are really easy to make. Um, let's look again. Well, we, we have the Whisper Bow. The strong arm hunter bow. Let's look at that. So fully upgraded, it would do 65 tear damage. And overdraw damage, I don't know what overdraw is, plus an increased critical hit chance. So 65. And... Our regular bow does what? 64. So almost the same. Fire hunter bow. Um, it's all fire. Fire, fire, fire. Or acid. For now, I think I'm going to stick with what I have. Um, neither of those, I mean, the the shredder thing might be useful, but I really like bows, so I don't want to try <laughs> something new. Let's look at our pouch upgrades. Okay, we have, if we get a J feather, oh boy. Can I have more than six 
Okay, hunter, arrow, quiver. Uh, precision, okay, six, this will take me to eight. Okay, I have a fox bow. I can do it. Yes. All right, this is a good upgrade. Can I upgrade it again? I need a horned lizard skin and a vulture wishbone. <laughs> what kind of crazy construction makes up these quivers? Um, that would take me up to 10. All right. Potions. I might as well upgrade this. I have two squirrel hides. I can use two. Let's look at the other ones. Trip wires. I do not care. Uh, light arrows. Yeah, I need the J feather. Resource pouch. Level 2, 30 to 36 berries. I don't know what 30 is. I don't remember seeing that number with my berries. Can't do it anyway. Bombs don't care about. Traps don't care about. All right. Might as well do the potion pouch. A prairie dog bone. <laughs> A rabbit hide. We haven't seen rabbits yet. All right. Really? Um, oh, let's... Okay. And probably the last thing we'll do. Let's look at skills. I've got... Thirty-nine skill points. <laughs> I can't believe it. Um... So, um, Chris Worthington mentioned um, increasing this, the power of the Resonator Blast. And I do use that quite a bit. Okay, Resonator Damage. Okay. Okay, plus 50%. That's good. All right, so let's get this plus 30% damage. Oh, I have to get this one. The Nora Warrior. A powerful melee combo. Common among Nora Warriors, useful in knocking down small machines and staggering larger ones. Okay. Three R1s and, and an R2. Let's get it. Maybe I can remember it. Knocking down small machines is good. Okay. Resonator build up. Okay, it builds up faster. Yeah, that's good. Critical strike deals more damage. Yes, I want that. What is this one in the middle? Critical boost, a valor surge. Okay, I would have to learn Energize duration. Okay, the target stays on there longer. That's worth having too. All right, let's get it. <laughs> the sound effects. Okay, and I could level it up. Three. Um, but I don't really care about Valor Surges. Okay. <laughs> R1... Shoot your, shooting your target with an arrow immediately after jump off deals extra damage. Okay. That looks fun. So you hit, hit them with R1 and then hold R2. All right, since I have so many skill points, I'm going to get it. Maybe I can try some of these. Um, I guess it only works against human opponents, though, so... I could try it in a melee pit, but I don't really care. All right, let's get this. Um, the resonator build up. What do we have? Okay, deal more damage with resonator blast. Okay. Keep going down. Critical strike. Yes. More damage. More. Okay. 100% damage. The Destroyer. 
a risky flurry of melee attacks that deal a massive amount of damage. R1, then pause, then R... Oh, boy. I don't care about learning things like that. Okay, this is good. Melee damage. Yes, I want that. Resonator build up. Okay. If I can get resonator build up, melee damage, energized duration. That's good. So, what's above? Okay, we have this. All right, so we'll get this. Wait. Learn previous skills. What? We have this? Oh, no, we don't have this. Power attack. Okay. Get that. This. What was this one? Melee damage. Yeah. That's the one we wanted. Okay. Power attack steal. Yeah, I want that too. I guess get it. Okay. I feel like we wasted <laughs> or <laughs> used. A lot of skill points here. Um, any good hunter ones? Oh. Weapon stamina still makes no sense to me. Um, YouTube user Elkry kind of explained it to me. Um, it's not the weapon's stamina. It's Aloy's stamina for the weapon. But the name... <laughs> Oh, I concentration plus. I want this, but I have to go all the way down through a bunch of junk that I don't care about to get to it. What's ammo expert? Okay, this would be good. Craft more ammunition from the same amount of resources. I actually do like that. Is there another one down here? Yeah. Um, take a lot of points to get all the way down there. I've just got these ones, three at the top. So to get down one, two, three, Four, five. It doesn't tell me. Okay, never mind. I'm counting, but it doesn't tell me how many skill points. Okay, this one. Let's use a point here. And then get deep concentration. Because I use that a lot. All right, two for this one. So it's probably going to be two, two, and maybe these are three. Ammo expert. Where's the other ammo expert? Did I? Yeah, I didn't get it. All right, I'm going to go down. Probably the last of my skill points to use here. Yeah, three, nine. Okay, that will leave me with zero skill points. Valor Surge, I do not care about, but I'll get increased concentration and ammo expert. Unless one of these is four, then I won't be able to do it. No, they're not. Okay, I used all my skill points. Workbench expert. That looked uh, interesting, but I didn't read it. I'm going to read it. What is workbench expert? Oh, I should get this. This one is good, too. Recover concentration faster. Where is it? Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, ammunition. Okay, I don't really care about that. 
Okay. Um, let's look at the map one more time. I don't know. I don't think I have. I had anything else planned. I'll have to look. Actually, I'm going to do it now. Um, I'm going to take a second and see if there's a solution to get this um, Vista Point Tower, get the Vista AR image back into my focus. I'll be back in one second. Okay, so I need to activate it in my quests. Collectibles, maybe? Vista Points. Plain song. Okay. Right, if I have this active, then I think the AR image will show up. We'll find out. Um, where is the campfire? I still haven't done any machine strike. Not going to in this video. Before this playthrough is over, I might, but, all right, I just need to go here, I think. I think I'll, it's already scanned into my focus. We'll find out. I enter. No, not yet. I could try to line up the Vista Point image again. I should be within range. Okay. All right. That did it. All right. Let's uh, go up, Aloy. Um. not here, right? It was the... Let me look at the map. Where's the... The tower was here. Yeah, okay, I want to go this way. Hopefully there are no machines up here, like there were last time. Come on, grab it. It's a yellow line, you can do it. A little bit of lightning here. Hopefully the power doesn't go out. Did I read this? This looks like a promising spot to stand. All right, I'm gonna try the that HM lookout. Seems promising. I could try to line up the image from there. What did she say? Got one here. Okay. Actually, I'm not sure. <laughs> Where? Well, assume it. I mean, this is really close. Alright. 
Um, plain songs, dishes have to be in the middle. At least it's morning. Uh, I'm in an agreement with Chris Worthington. This is not as much fun. Hey, that is so close. She mentioned a lookout. It's not here. Right? Pretty sure I'm close. <laughs> You're close, Aloy, but is that a tower there? That's no longer here, maybe? Okay. Got it. Okay, yeah. All right. I thought uh, that other tower was part of it. Okay, fifteen hundred experience. Well, so that's what it used to look like here. All right, let's, uh, what is this here? And did I read it before? It says it's new. Okay, Lost Treasures of the Indian Ocean. Indian Ocean, August 4th, 2051. Below the skids of our vert stretches nothing but open, featureless water. This area of the sea was once home to 200 islands, rich with sea life. They were a playground of the famous and wealthy. Seconds after we drop a submersible drone, holographic underwater images fill the vert's main cabin. From the drone's perspective, we see all that has been lost to the waves. Drowned concrete resorts bordered by white bleached structures. The remnants of the once colorful, vibrant living reefs that brought tourists to the Maldives. Here and there we can see life still clinging on, but with rising seas, acidity increases, and the loss of the currents that once brought nutrition to these mid-ocean rocks, this haven of life has dwindled to a shadow of what it once was. Are these lost treasures of the Pacific gone forever? Isha Lag Laghari of the Trans-Indian Aquatic Development Center doesn't think so. As she sees it, the first step in bringing life back to the reefs is to envision what they once were. Hence the images I see before me now, near barren underwater rocks suddenly bursting with a rainbow of holographic plants and animals. As a brilliant orange clownfish swims past my nose, she describes her project as both a window into the past and a guide to the future. She hopes that with time, effort, and new advances in cloning and transplanting, perhaps one day, both here and in oceans around the world, life can... data corrupted. We don't know who said this. Okay. This is, That's a really odd note to find here in the southwest USA but you know maybe a plane crashed or maybe it's just somebody's reading material who knows all right as we look out over this stunning vista I think that is it for this video I didn't have anything else planned we killed a Thunderjaw, what more can you ask for? That fight was a lot of fun, running around, hit and run combat, shooting off components. I really enjoyed it. And we used all of our skill points, so I don't need to worry about those. I really haven't connected with the skill system in Forbidden West. Zero Dawns was much better. I liked its skill tree a lot, a lot more. I just feel like um, Valor Surges, um, Weapon Stamina, I'm not missing anything. I don't feel like I'm missing anything by not using them. Maybe I am, but I really don't feel like I am. Um, I'm happy just to use the bow and uh, the spear and continue as I have been. In the next video, we are going to be heading west, finally, into Tanakh territory. Who knows what we'll find? Hopefully, some subroutines so we can get Gaia's processing power back up. Thank you for watching, and I will see you soon. Got it. 